Do I want one? No. Mr. X Parrot, thanks for 21 months as well. Welcome back. Alright, so we are going to play. Wait a second though. Before we start, okay, before we start, let's laugh. Let's laugh at, at some of. Oh, okay, look, I'll show you. Okay, let's laugh at this one first, okay? My nutty bag of balls. This is the one we were working on on Friday? Were we playing this on Friday? You love the Monday morning bit war? Me too. Okay. All right. Get ready to laugh, everybody. It's really funny. Okay. It's gonna it's gonna make you laugh on this Monday morning. An otherwise dreary Monday morning is gonna be filled with hilarious laughter when you see this part. Okay. This is the one that we were working on on Friday. Okay. Ready? All right. Get ready to laugh. Get get ready for some big belly laughs, everybody. It's gonna be really funny. Yeah. Good. All right. Here we go. <laughs> All right. This is what we were working on on Friday. I mean, it's not it's not that bad, but I've come a long way since Friday. Okay, let's just put it that way. I mean, we did have a roller coaster, which is which is something. Look, let's just take a look at this roller coaster quick. Okay, we're ready. We're ready for some action, Rhonda. Set us off, American Arrow. This is the American Arrow roller coaster. Oh. We're off. We're strapped in. We're strapped on. Here we go. I hope you're all laughing. This is a... Well, actually, this is a pre-built one, so it's, it's probably pretty good. Oh, yeah. Here we go. You're crying. Yeah, me too. I'm crying too. Look. Hang on a second. I don't want to watch this. Okay. Let's let's laugh at this thing that we built here with the ivy for hats fantastic with a floating shop in the middle It's pretty funny. We had all these rides and stuff. And we had all this stuff for people to eat we Had these small paths and this crazy flying ride where you You're in like a glider, but you're not quite in a glider. It looks kind of fun. I'd go on that It's not quite goofy sky school, which is pretty good. I got whiplash when I went on that last time um, there's this, like, spinny ride and the teacups and stuff. Anyway, we were just sort of getting used to the game, right? Okay, now check this one out. Okay, I started working on this one over the weekend, which is pretty fun. It's a little bit better, okay? I went for, like, a themed approach, and, uh, and I was practicing. I did some practicing. No? Check this out, yeah. Did I work out the paths yet? Yeah, I mean, I, it's a work in progress, but... I'm more comfortable with the paths, right? Strap yourself in and feel, feel the G's. That's right. Okay, good. No. I installed this and started playing the other day, and you stream this, yeah? Concordance. I don't know if concordance is the word, but let's just say concordance is maybe the word. Okay, so this, so this is the one. I don't know how much money it's making, but I, I was playing this over the weekend, okay, briefly. I made this this park instead, okay, which is a little bit better than the other one. Look, it's a little it's got it's it's a little bit more coherent, okay? You walk in the front here and look at this. Future world. Uh, you've got future world. Look at all these people with their space helmets. They bought some space helmets. And then this is going to be pirate land over here, okay? So we got pirate land and over here Future world and look when you come through future world look it's very futuristic, isn't it? It's got future toilets. It's got spaceships everywhere Look, it's got like a little Look at this hat stand that I made with a radar dish on top. I Like that and then there's this like pool here with some aliens sleeping and some other guys guarding the pool and look There's some smoke coming out of the pool. I made it dirty water because that's the pipe from the from the bathroom because I wanted to pretend that there was bathroom water coming out into this little pond. And then we got all these rides, and I just built this roller coaster over here. Look at all the people here. There's a ton of people here. So this is Future Land, and then I was starting to work on Pirate Land over here. Look, see, there's a boat and, like, a whole bunch of cafes, and look, there's a pirate picnic area here, too. Hi, Sips. Yep. Hope you had the daddest of dad days yesterday with oh, plenty thanks, of man. chocolate milk and the top 21st birthday the other week I missed. And if I don't see you, have a great <laughs> Christmas 2025 as well. Oh, okay, bye. Oh, Crelly. Always good to see you, man. I hope, you're I hope you're doing good and you're not too busy. All right. 
So this was a little bit better. This, this one was the start of something special. Look, I did like some landscaping. See, look, I made like a pirate cove and stuff. And I was going to have like a big lead up to a castle and, and everything. But we're going to ditch all this. I'm going to start from scratch. And we're going to work on Jeff Land. Okay, look I, look, I mastered the grid cues. Look at all my grid cues and stuff. Some big cues. Keep the people strapped into the cues. And then you want some people like short cues so that they can go to the stores and buy cappuccinos and stuff like that. That's a shitty roller coaster. What, this one? I mean, it's not the best, is it? It was just a pre-made one. I just sort of plunked it in because we needed like a big ticket ride. Because I don't think we're making much money here. No, see, look. We're not, we're not turning a profit at all. I don't know what's happening, but... I mean, who knows? Look. A lot of my staff are like tired and unhappy. But anyway. We're not going to play this one. Okay? We're going to exit to the main menu and we're going to start a new one. Yeah? No? I should make custom roller coasters. Oh, I'm not quite at that point yet. I had to do one for a... For a campaign look at the look i've done all these campaign missions look i'm working on chief beef's meaty challenge right now but look i nine out of nine captain lockjaw's buried treasures princess amelie's fairy tale and now i'm working on chief beef's meaty challenge it's been pretty fun so far like i said i played a bit over the weekend and i liked it it was good all right challenge we're gonna do um, a challenge in start your park with limited money and build that dream park in this lush environment. Crisp, rich, sandy. Dream getaway destination. Winter Wonderland. Let's go Decidious, yeah? I love beef. A new fantastic, yeah, it's true, eh? I should watch 6969 by Ninja Sex Party, okay, I will. How about making an anal theme park? We could do. It is gonna be Jeff Land, so let's do medium, okay? Guest happiness drops steadily. Some items have been researched. Breakdown rate is average and ride reputation declines steadily. Many items researched. Guest happiness drops slowly and breakdown rate is slow. What's this ride reputation decline thing? Is that just part of the challenge, or is that just a mechanic? The snow will make blood from accidents pop out. Rides get boring for guests. Over time it gets old, but can you fix that by doing the, um, by spending money on refurbishing it? They don't like shitty old, okay. But can you, can you do the refurbish thing to, to make them not seem old anymore? You can rebrand. Yes. Okay, that's fine then. We'll go for medium. Alright. We'll do medium. Is that Terps on the top left? Yeah, it is, yeah. It's young Terps. Young Terps. Okay, good. We have to build a coaster at least 500 miles long. No problem. We got it. Alright, so the entrance of our park is here, right? So we're gonna go paths. Let's keep it, let's keep it similar, okay? We'll go paths and we'll make a very wide path to start with, okay? And then let's get on the grid so that we can spend all of my money on paths, okay? This is the, this is like the, the front entrance to the park, okay? I've got a great idea for this. Mr. Ideas is just teeming with ideas, okay? We're gonna spend a whole bunch of money to start with on the grand entrance to our park, okay? Length. Hey Angle Sips, snap. I got a real stinker for you. Oh, what yeah. do roller coasters and toilets have in common? Um, people go wee ee ee ee. People go wee ee ee ee. Okay, check this out. You know what? Good one. That's a good one. Thanks so much Opera Geek 91 thanks for that. Okay, is the width okay? How do I make a perfect circle? Is it possible to... Okay. It's not perfect, but it is a circle. 
Okay, we're done. We did it. Look. No. You can't make a perfect circle. Make it perfect. Good luck, Sips. Hope your theme park is as good as your streams. Much love less than three. Okay, thanks so much, uh, Beertron2000. Best park. Okay, hang on a second. So how do I... How do I make... How do I make a perfect circle? Like this, right? Okay, we're gonna make the Quake logo. Hi everybody, welcome to my stream. Today we're working on making the Quake logo in Roller Coaster Tycoon. No, not not quite, okay. Not quite. Let's get all of our money back. I'm gonna pause the game as well, okay? Alright, length three. We have to have a perfect circle, okay? And there's a good reason for it, too. It has to be perfect, because this is gonna be where people first enter into Jeffland. And as such, they need to have a perfect experience. Okay. We'll get there eventually. <laughs> make a cross hey, and then use that to make a circle. Finally, an earlier again. stream. All right. If you were going to play XCOM 2 again, remember you've got the DLC I bought you, Wink Wink Nudge Nudge, so it yes. will be a different experience. I rem Thanks yes. for all the rim world you played. Hey, no love problem. you, ships. Oh, I love you too, man. Thanks so much, and thanks so much for the um, for that DLC um, Meow 369. I appreciate it. We'll play it again soon. Don't worry. I've got a I've got a hankering for some for some XCOM. Okay. Hang on a second. So now, from this side, I can go like this. Oh, it's so close. It's so nearly there. I think if we do this, That's pretty good, right? That's not too bad. Go bigger. No. It's pretty good. We did it. We did it. It's not bad. There's probably... It's... It's... It's okay. You know what? It's passable. It's passable. Okay. Next step. We push. We're gonna go full intensity. Perfect. Now let's fill this bitch up with some water. Okay, now let's smooth it. Look, I know it looks jaggedy, guys, but it's fine. We can fix it up. We can cover it with some flowers and shit. Maybe some rocks. Right? And then in the middle, we can have a fountain, too. Statues and centerpieces. Look, we can have... We can have Jeff standing right in the center with water coming out of his hands. How does that float your boat? Just end the stream right now. I already lost a lot of money. I know, I had to pause the game. What? Now it looks like an asshole. 
Right. Spend spend at the park budget on a water filled goat sea. Yeah. Well, look, we'll come back to this. Well, we need to make some money first, right? Okay, so the idea is you enter Jeffland, okay? It's free entry. You walk in and you're greeted with a huge statue of Jeff, just like Walt Disney, you know? The statue of Walt Disney where he's holding Mickey's hand, except it'll probably just be Jeff. Holding a doobie or something, I don't know. Whatever Jeff likes, okay? And then the idea is we're gonna have like forks like we're gonna have branches not forks we're gonna have branches pathing off here right okay so like here we're gonna have fairy tale land and here wild west land and here like shopping and hotels and stuff and here sci-fi land and here pirate land and then i also got the spooky dlc and i got the studios tour thing DLC as, as well, right? Somebody poisoned the water hole? Pirate land. Anal land. There's there's no anal land, okay? This is anal land right here. It's like a little a little goatsy. I mean, we could even make the the paths look like arms and then have like little branches here that look like fingers tearing open <laughs> the butthole. <laughs> we could call it goatsy land instead of Jeff land, no? The boat ride is going to be epic. Yeah, I know. Can you imagine? Just like a little toot toot going around the circle. All right, so we blew like most of our money uh, on that. So we're going to have to start things off with... Um, we have to make some money, right? Okay, so let's go with... Okay. This way, this way is going to be to like dumb land, okay? Where we're just going to put like a bunch of random crap. It's gonna just branch off like this, okay, into dumb land, and then we're gonna have a ride because we need one. Uh, what can be our our signature ride? Whirly rig? It's not very exciting. We need something. Kind of, Psychola could be good. Insanity, which we can't afford. We can if we can afford Psychola though. Okay. <laughs> I vote we get Psychola since it's exciting. It'll get the people in and then we can start making some money. And then you know what? We can just get rid of Dumbland when we're done. When we're done with it, right? We might have to take out a loan. There's that about it too. Okay, we'll place the exit like here. And then let's do the... Hopefully I can afford this. We're gonna make a big queue so that we can get a lot of people in here to make some money to save us from going under. Sure, that's fine. Okay. And then let's go with this. Okay, now we just need a little bit of money for some scenery. And we could just cheat a little bit by using, look at this alley scene, bush, bush collection. Okay, hang on. We just need to make some money, so I'm just gonna put in as much crap as I can here, so I can jack up the price, and then we can get all the people in. Some of these scenes cost a lot of money. Luckily, Clay Pots does not. This is just to get us started, okay? We're gonna get rid of all this stuff after. We're just get- this is just to get us some money to start with. Look, okay, perfect. We can put a whole fair in here. We can go for like a medieval theme, okay? Hi. Hi. Can I get a dumb ride named after me? Sure. Thanks. Okay, Cheers. we have- we have 48 bucks left. GLHF. Our scenery rating around here is only 57%, even though I've added all this stuff, which is not the best. Okay, so we're gonna have to spend a tiny bit more money. Once we get some people on this ride, though, we're gonna be laughing all the way to the bank. Right? We're gonna laugh our, our way to the bank. So that puts us at 68%. Okay, we'll call this Psychola. Um, 
We'll charge seven bucks for the pleasure, and let's open it up. All right, let's make some money. Okay, good. Here they come. Here comes the money, everybody. Watch this. Here they go. We'll get rid of all this after, okay? We're just trying to raise funds so that we can make the best Jeff land, right? The queue is too long. No, no, it's fine. Trust me. Trust me. Look. Off they all go. Some people didn't want to go. Look. Here comes the money, baby. Look at all this money. We got like 200 bucks. Shit. These guys did not like the ride. Look. Oh, there are no toilets in this park. No, you're right about that. There's none. But we're gonna add some. There's one big toilet here. I don't know why people are complaining. We have to start somewhere, right? Success. Yeah. Let's go to the park with one ride. You say that now, but just watch in like a couple hours time when we have two rides. You'll be singing a different tune. Um, Meow369 and Dawn Trotter. Thanks so much for the donations, by the way. I appreciate it. Okay, so we have a little bit of money now. Now we just have to attract some more guests to the park. And then we have to start also working on um, this place up here. This bit up here is going to be um, like refreshment land, right? We're going to have all of our hotels and stuff are going to be up here. We're going to spend some money on paths to get us started, okay? And then we're going to... Oh, I wonder if I could widen that a bit more even. Okay, let's go with something like this, okay? So, we're gonna need like like an entrance so that people realize that it's refreshment land. But I can't afford to make it right now. I've got, you know what? My mind is, is, is writing checks that my, that my bank balance can't cash right now. I have these huge ideas, but I don't have the money to do it. It's gonna be a bit of a slow one, but Trust me, look, we've got a great foundation here already for Jeff Land. Look at this. Look at this. It's going to be truly spectacular, okay? I'm not even joking. Not even joking about that. It's going to be something else. Okay, so the theme that we want to go for inside our um, 900 bucks for a toilet. My god. We want to just go for like the 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 like the planet coaster sort of theme for like you know where people are gonna come and buy stuff. So there's gonna be like a food court, places for them to buy merchandise. There'll be some buildings for hotels and stuff like that. Um, we'll have like some nice trees and paths and stuff. It'll be great. No, bad Mr. Ideas. Just put the basic toilet without the decorations. Well, that's no fun. That's no fun. I like decorations. I like it. I like making it look the part, you know? At least we don't have to spend money on staff, right? We Because we have not, not a single member of staff. Okay, I'll tell you what. Just to make people happy, and since this is all temporary any, anyway, let's just go for like a really bog standard toilet block, okay? It's open, it's ready to go. <laughs> There, look, we've had a customer. Now people should be happy, right? That they go to the toilet. We can always move this later. We can move it later on. Yeah? Let them eat shit. Just to make money, yeah. We're just gonna make some money off the toilets. You know what? That's a good idea. Let's charge a buck for the toilet as well. In, in the interest of making money, look. Yeah, we just made like six bucks from the toilet. Good. We're off to a great start here, guys. We're off to a really good start. No? Is there entry cost? No, there's not. Maybe to s help us make some money, we could have like a small entry cost of five measly dollars. There. Let's see if we have any takers. Oh, look at that. We made like ten bucks. We'll make kids free. Look, there we go. Here comes the money. Look, we're rolling in it already. What a setup. How could we ever lose? Am I right? Entry fee with free rides. 
I don't know. I, I tried to make it work on one of the scenarios, and it doesn't really work. The problem is, I think the problem is, is that the, um, the, the way that the time works in the game, right? Because, like, see these guys that just entered the park? They'll be in the park for, like, three months. <laughs> uh, so, you know, every... You, you really need to have a steady, steady, steady flow of willing customers um, coming through and paying to keep all of your rides going. And I think it's I think you make more money by having a ride with a hundred percent scenery rating around it, and you can just jack up the prices. You I think you make way more money in the end like that. The problem is I spent too much money on paths in the lake. Nah, come on. Yeah, I know it's three like three like. They won't leave for like three months. I know, very loyal. We need some hotels for like those lengthy stays. Yeah. Three months without a toilet? Now come on, look, we've got one now. There's a toilet right here. Let's see what our finances look like. Oh, look. We're making money. Look at how much money we're making, guys. 20 bucks. It's a huge profit. We just got to get things spinning up here. Look. We shouldn't lose that much money from the toilets now. And then... Before you know it, we'll have enough money to um, maybe buy like a, a drink stall or something. Yeah. Save money for a Loch Ness monster. No one is using the roller coaster. They just walk to, up to it and walk away. Oh, yeah. It's too expensive because... Oh, it's too expensive because we've had to... Because we're charging people. Look. It's too expensive. Okay. Let's try to make all of our money off Psychola, okay? Instead of having the park entrance fee. I would like a multi-pass for 10 poops, kind sir. Okay. Thank you. Little Billy, thanks so much, man. I appreciate it. So now, now the problem is, is that these people are in the park and they've paid to get into the park. And they'll never go on Psychola now. Because they paid five bucks to enter the park in the first place. But new people coming into the park for free will go on Psychola. Right? No? Per ride pricing was the best on Roller Coaster Tycoon. Is it still like that in this game? It seems to be, yeah. I mean, may I think maybe after a while, like if if we can have Jeff Land up and running and super established with like a high uh, park rating and like over three thousand guests or whatever, we could probably go for like the park entry fee and make all the rides free. But I, until then, I don't think you can do it. I, I think it's too hard to do. You just lose money, right? Because you, you need to have a, a really steady stream of people coming through to make it balance out for each month. No? Just go in sandbox mode and let your dreams run wild. No, I want to I let my dreams run wild in, um, in challenge mode, though. I like, I like the financial side of it. I like trying to make it all balance out and stuff. I don't want to just have free money. Although, it could be fun doing it with free money, but I kind of like the challenge. No? Am I going to play RimWorld again? Yeah, probably, yeah. How would I improve this game? I don't know. I haven't played it enough. Probably, I, I'm i not the best person to ask on how to improve a game. Like, I think, from what I've played so far, it's pretty great. Like, I like it a lot. Alright. Should we get a very temporary place for people to buy something to drink? Like a milkshake. How much does this cost? 200 bucks. Okay. There we go. Now people can buy milkshakes too. That should help us. That should help us make some more money. Look, after they've been on Psychola, they'll be really tired and thirsty. They'll want to come out here and then, bam. They'll have a drink. And we can even give them somewhere to sit. Spooky park bench. Sci-fi park bench. Park bench 2. Okay. There, you can sit down, you clowns. Also, don't make a mess either here. Chuck all your stuff in the garbage. Alright, good. Look at the lineup for Cosmic Cow Milkshakes. They're loving it. They're spending TV money. Slash sips. Home of monorails and roundabouts. Yeah. Name a toilet after me. Kiss, kiss. I remain Anthrax. All right, here you go, Anthrax. Look, Anthrax's toilet. Here you go. Done. Thanks so much, man. I appreciate it. 
Okay. Guests think that Psychola is great value. That's good. And we're making money. We're making money off milkshakes and we're making money off this one ride with all this dumb scenery around it that is just temporary. We're going to get rid of it. As soon as we start making a little bit of money, we're going to start working on getting all of our stuff set up in here. I don't have a staff building. Okay, we'll have to think about getting one of those as well, probably. No? The slowest money making you've ever witnessed? I know, we're on fastest speed as well. It's crazy, eh? Maybe I shouldn't have spent all my money on this thing at the start, but I needed to have... I needed to have some sort of idea of what was what we what we were working with and I think what we've made is great and I think once we have some money and we can tart it up and make Jeffland the greatest destination on earth then I think you'll look back to this time when you said that you were making money really slow and say you know what it was all worth it no how long is temporary well probably quite a while actually I mean, when you think that the, the success of the park really hinges off the back of this whole area here. Oh my god. Psychola broke down. We don't even have a dude. We might have to restart, guys. Or take a loan. We might have to take a loan. We don't even have a guy to fix Psychola. Our main money maker. Look, we're in the hole now. Alright, come on, Ricky. Get it fixed, please. Quickly. The good news is, though, is that once it's fixed... They're all going to queue up again and we're going to make a ton of money. Look, it's open. No, no, don't leave. Don't come back. Come back. We need your money. I feel like Jeff Land got off to a pretty rough start here. And it's all because of this. <laughs> oh, it looks glorious though. I don't want to have to redo that. Is there some way that I can save this whole area as a blueprint so that I can just plop it down after? It doesn't really work like that, does it? You can change the ride music to your own music and sound bits. Oh, that's cool. No, please don't leave. Yeah, no, we can't afford for them to. Okay, look, they're all coming back. Look, our one ride is open again, baby. That's right. Next time it breaks down, hopefully we'll be able to fix it quicker. Good. Look, the money's pouring in. There's a lot of people that don't want to go on it, though. Oh, it's because the queue is massive, apparently. Maybe we need to go for the fast pass. Come on, come on, come in. It's not that big of a queue. Look, there's only like five people in the queue. We'll get through them in no time. Good, good. Can I make a blueprint for landscapes? I guess not. Just buy some more rides. What is it even that's costing me money? Um, just the ride alone is costing money. It's like a maintenance upkeep fee on the rides, right? Only three months of queue time. Just take a loan out. I mean, we could probably take a loan Look at how much interest, though. It costs a, th a thousand to two thousand bucks a month. There are a lot of overflowing bins in the park. Okay. We're in trouble here. We're in big trouble. We have to take out a loan. Also, we have to pause the game. Okay. Right. We need something that's going to get us out of this hole. Okay. We're going to have to go for the Jailer's Den. No. The Witch's Haunt. No, that's going to be part of Spooky Land. Steam. No. A coaster? Flight of the Dragon. The Madness. Oh. <laughs> I don't think that's going to help us either. Okay. What about Insanity? It's got, it's got pretty good excitement rating. Higher than Psychola. Okay. Once again, Dumbland is getting... Okay, look, now we can make some money. Now we can make some serious money. Okay, we're gonna add this here. Place the exit on this side. It's gonna connect up this queue here. Okay, temporary dun dumb land is getting some extras thrown at it, okay? Just, just so we can make some money. Because we're out of money, it turns out. Hang on a second. Okay. Well, we have some money for scenery too, which means we can jack up the price here. What's this one at right now? 9%. Okay, good. Scenery. Let's go for a blueprint of scenery. 
Um, mmm. Mmm. Dragons and knights in tents. McDonald's adds salt to their drinks so people buy more drinks. Yeah. Is it possible to add laxatives to shakes in this game so people poop more? You can do all that kind of stuff in this game, yeah. You can add, like, cheese to the burgers to make it so that people get thirstier and all that kind of stuff. You can do it all in this. It's great. Knight's battle. Look at this knight's battle. Oh, I see. It's like a movie set. That's so cool. There's a knight fight scene here, too. Look at this. Oh, that's awesome. Okay. What about the jester stage? Okay, let's set up a jester stage here in Dumbland. Okay. We'll spend a little bit of money tarting up this queue. It's at 100% now. Okay, good. So, insanity. We can charge like 10 bucks for this now and open it up. Good. And now we can hopefully make some money. And get some more people in, okay? Dumb land is taking shape. Dumb temporary land is taking shape, okay? This is what's going to make us all of our money. And then we can start getting some other stuff set up. We've got a little bit of, of money now, so we can get some proper stuff set up while we're making money in the background, okay? So we want a planet toilet block. But we don't need toilets. So we won't get a planet toilet block just yet. Okay. We do need somewhere to eat. Chief beef. Okay. Let's go with a chief beef in here. Chief. Chief beef. Okay. And let's also get... Hang on a second, guys. Custom. Um, props? Arches. Ooh. That's not big enough. We're gonna have to make our own arch. That That is not big enough. We might have to just make our own arch. How's this going? This is going good. Look at all the people swarming in here now. Look, they want to go on these rides. That's great. Some people are going to make this wa lonely walk all the way out here. Okay. What kind of art should we go for for, like, hotel land? We're going to have to go into building. Custom. Oh, look at these. Look at this downtown building. It's like New York. We can call this one Hotel New York. Look at all these fancy houses and stuff. Oh, that's so good. Look, we can even have a downtown skyscraper. Look at the size of this. It could be like the centerpiece. You know, like Disney World has the castle. Jeffland can just have a, a big skyscraper. We need, you know what we need? We need the Sipsco Tower, don't we? We need somebody to make that in Planet Coaster, and then we can use that. Some of this stuff is really cool. Look at this one. Oh, man. Some of the buildings in this game are awesome. They must have taken forever to make, too. Look at this, a sci-fi power generator. Oh, fuck, that looks so cool. Look, we can just plonk it right there, and that can be, like, the centerpiece of the park. I think we're actually making money now. Oh, yeah, we are! See, look, Dumbland is paying off! Okay. We're gonna need to hire... Not you. We need a couple of janitors. Just to keep... Keep the place tidy. And we're going to need some security guys before long as well. Good. What? Because the staff quit. I don't think we lost any staff, did we? No. We're close to. We're close to losing some staff. We're getting tired. There's nowhere to take a break at all. Okay, don't worry. We're going to sort you out. We're going to give you a place to take a break. Where does that come under? Facilities. Toilets. Staff management. Custom. Staff management. Okay. Just so that these guys don't cry too much. <laughs> That's the staff room. <laughs> it's just a closet. 
All right, they need it though. They need the, to go there and have a rest. Like I keep saying, this is just temporary. We're gonna we're gonna build it up better, right? The black box of horror. The staff from the chief beef quit. Oh my god, you're right. That is unbelievable. Okay. All right, the chief beef is back open. Let's get some people lining these roads and stuff here. That'll be good. Okay, now let's start working on the centerpiece. <laughs> let's start working on the centerpiece for Jeffland. Because that makes sense, right? Look, we can do an iron fence all the way around here. Do we want... Do we want an iron fence or do we want like a haunted house wooden fence? Or do we want... Oh, look at this. This could be the one for us right here, boys. Look at that, that looks special. Doesn't that just look special? Listen to the dong sound it makes when it goes down to... Bong. Oh, yeah. You gotta, just gotta angle it perfectly here. Man, this is it's just like playing City Skylines again, but it's not City Skylines, and also the detailing is a little bit easier to do than it is like on that. Could you make yard. a theme song on entrance, just like Energy Landia in Zeta Poland has? Cheesy and illogical. What? I don't know what that means. You lost me big time. What did you say? Could I make a theme song on entrance, just like Energylandia in Zator, Poland? Cheesy and illogical. Simple Polish guy. Okay, I'll try to, yeah. I think that could be fun. You know what else we need to do? When people enter Jeffland, we have to shower them in confetti immediately as well. Which we'll get to eventually too. We have to have a confetti shower. It's like that time in Parks and Recreation when they were at the strip club and the and the glitter ball exploded and Ron Swanson was having a, a breakfast buffet and he had to <laughs> use his coat to shield his his breakfast buffet from the glitter. That's what it's gonna be like entering Jeffland every time. Do you guys remember that? Look money. What's wrong with the money? Oh yeah, we're in the crapper again, big time. All I want to do is add this beautiful fence. Look, it's taken shape now though. It's looking great, isn't it? So insanity broke down, but it's been fixed and it's open again. And now look, it we're just like slamming people onto the ride. So we should be okay. Our profit, not great. Look, October, we lost about a thousand bucks. Looks like March, we're also going to lose about a thousand bucks. This might not be enough to keep us afloat, guys. It's gonna take a long time for us to get all of this done. We got a lot of work to do here and not a lot of money coming in. We should have the, the loan paid off pretty soon though. So at least there's that, right? Tell me when we drop below 4,000 bucks, okay? That's when I need to start worrying. As soon as we drop below 4,000 bucks, start screaming, okay? Look at this. It's looking great, though. Look. It's worth it's worth all the time that I'm taking to do this, right? It's totally worth it. The park just manages... It's just managing itself back here. <laughs> Look. It's really good. Do 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 what? Are you counting down? Oh. The fence looks fantastic. Yeah, I know. It's fucking great. It's just what we need in Jeff Land. If Jeff's watching, which I doubt he is, I think it's like 4 in the morning where he lives, but he's an early riser. If Jeff's watching, he's going to be so impressed with Jeff Land as it, as it is. I know Jeff. I know what he likes. He likes this. He likes this. Doo doo doo. Oh, look at that, guys. Look, when this is all done, 
It's gonna look like a dream. Okay, we're about to go below 4,000 bucks. I'm just in time. Okay. Let me look at my finances quick. Yeah, we're still losing a lot of money. These rides aren't cutting it for us. We need more people in the park as well. And both of our janitors probably need to have a pay rise as well because they're gonna be going nuts. Okay, good. I think they train up when they go to the... Um... That's not good. That is not good. Look at all these people demanding refunds. Okay, it's been fixed though. Everybody back on, quick. Come on. We need this money. There we go, look. Oh, yeah. Here we go. They're all going, they're all clamoring to get back on now. We should hopefully be able to get back up over 4,000 bucks. If not, we might have to restart. No? I'm charging for the bathroom, yeah. A dollar. I'm charging a dollar to use the bathroom as it stands right now. This is how desperate we are for money. This, these fences are going to put us out of business, I think. Okay, tell me if we go drop below 3,000 bucks, okay? I think the loan is what's causing the problems here. Look. We're almost there. We've almost paid it off. We're like a third of the way there. Oh my god. I love it. I love it. I love how this is looking. The only thing is, though, is that I think we'll get to a point where they won't line up perfectly. And I think we want that point to happen sort of at the start here. Because then we could just... At the start here, we can just sack off the fences and have like a little outcropping thing here with a statue who has is juggling water. No? Stop building fences. Don't fucking tell me what to do. I don't turn up at your house go into your dad garage and tell you what to do with your time. Why are you doing it to me? I'm just trying to live my life here. I'm just trying to live my life and do the things I enjoy doing, okay? And one of those things is placing fences in a video game. And trees. I like doing that too. I like to place tr lots of trees as well. You're gonna tell me to stop doing that? Why don't you just ask me to just stop being me while you're at it? You want me to just stop being myself? You want me to just start playing some Minecraft or like some Fortnite or something instead? Maybe I should just do that. Yeah? Stop being such a poor park manager. <laughs> Minecraft, please. Does anyone still play Minecraft though? Like there's other games out there, right? We've got to be over it by now. Just Duncan. <laughs> Just Duncan plays Minecraft. Okay. That's hilarious. What a guy. Okay. <laughs> we're like half done the fence. It's looking pretty tight. Ah, oh, look, we're doing okay for money too. We're fine. We're doing good. Yeah. Did it. Okay, what are we gonna surround this water with though? We're gonna need like some bushes or something. We have to start planning on what that's gonna look like. In a world. In a world where, oh yeah. What if we do like this to hide? Look at these nice rosy bushes. Or maybe I just put this scal scalviola around How's that look? It looks a little bit wacky when you're coming in though, right? You think the rose bushes will look a little bit better?
What about these things? They don't look too bad. Oh, yeah, they look pretty good, actually. I think I could get used to these. Huh. Oh, my God. Where's all my money? Oh, it's because um, insanity broke down. But, 2k down. I know, it's just because insanity broke down. It's refunds. Look, we're going to go right back up once people go back on the ride. It's fine. Don't worry about it. it. Spends thousands on a lake and covers the view of the lake. No, what are you talking about? You can still look. You can still see over the lake. There's too many people trying to use the milkshake stand right now. Okay, so what do we think here? I don't like these, so let's get rid of these. So it's it's a toss up between I think I think these ones. I think if we go all the way around with those, they're pretty good, right? I've calculated size of the lake, the pie, and the length of the fence. The fence one T match up. You will have a hole or overlapping. It's fine. We're ready for that. We're we're ready for it. Thanks for calcul <laughs> Thanks, mathematician, for calculating the um, the fence for us as well. That's really good. That's that's the kind of people that we need in chat. People who are willing to go the extra mile, calculating the size of the lake and whether or not our fences are gonna fit in and around said lake. Thanks so much, mathematician. But it's fine. There's ways around it, right? What we're gonna do is when we get here, we're actually you know what? We're probably just gonna delete like. That one, that one, and that one as well. And then we'll try to have it line up to like around here. And then we'll have like a little bit that crops out a bit. And then we'll put a statue on there of Jeff. And hopefully somebody will clean up all this puke as well. That would be good too, right? Okay. We're fine. We're fine. Once this loan is... So we're like halfway there with the loan too. Once the loan's paid off... And it's just going to be pure profit, baby. And we'll have a really cool lake to show for it as well. We just have to survive to that point. But you know what? I feel like we can do it. And then the first step of Jeff Land will have been achieved. A cool, spicy entrance for all of the people that come to Jeff Land to think, you know what? This is something special. <laughs> This place is something special. This is the kind of place that I want to get married in. This is the kind of place I want to bring my kids to. Time after time after time. Because I don't want to think about going anywhere else. We're a, we're a, we're a frequent, frequent visitor at Jeff Land. So we can just do like an automatic rebooking. No? But the fish aren't paying for it? What? Paying for this wall that we're making? No, they are not. We have not forced the fish to pay for this wall. God. This is some serious painstaking detail, though. Do you think it's going to be all worth it in the end? Would you guys be mad if I changed my mind later on and I was like, Yeah, you know what? This fence isn't doing it for me anymore. I need a different fence. And I had to come back. There's got to be an easier way to do this, though, right? Or is this... Literally the only only way to do it. You like it? No. Mr. Ideas is a real bad man. Is there is there like a, a like a line tool thing like in City Skylines where I could just do this easier? No. Mr. Ideas is a failure. What are you talking about? There's at least one other person in the chat that's loving this right now. Okay. And when I find out who that is. Well, I don't know what I'm going to do, but I'll be really proud. I'll be really proud of you if that helps at all. Look at this. Let's, let's pretend for a minute that it's all done by looking at this cheaty view. Look at that. It looks perfect. 
a white floral bush. Who's ready to go bankrupt? Not me. Not today, my friend. Not today. We're gonna turn this boat around, trust me. If insanity would stop fucking breaking down anyway, we'd be fine, I think. It seems to break down like every five seconds. Okay, it's been fixed. All right, everybody back on. There you go. No, no, come on, everybody back on. Really, we need the money. We're running low. We really need to get Herbert over here to pick up some of this trash, too. These guests are not going to be happy with all this trash on the ground. Where's all, my, where's all my money? For fuck's sakes. Look, we were actually profitable in July. And then it's insanity okay, broke Sips. down again. Even if your park is losing money as you play with fences, you don't make Minecraft videos for the two people that still want them. And even if you never go back to New Vegas to throw dynamite at people, know that chat still loves you. <laughs> Mostly. Oh my god. Oh my god. Why are Hi, we not Daddy making o, any more plus money? help. For lunch, do I get a burrito with guac or a burrito with sour cream? Um... What are the options again? A burrito. Yeah, get it with sour cream, Bernard Stiff. And Alice K, thanks so much for the donation as well. And Bernard, thanks thanks very much as well. Okay, we're almost out of money. I don't even know how this is happening. I don't know how we're so low on money. We had 4,000 bucks not five minutes ago. Those fences cost like a dollar each. Where did all my money go? Don't worry, guys. We're making profits. We're, we look at this. Finally, we're profitable again. Look, 185 bucks. There, it's all coming together now. Look, it's all coming. Fence upkeep. We got. We were so close to finishing the fence as well. Look, maybe I should like. Maybe I should get back on to the fence. So at least we can finish the fence when the ship goes under. At least we'll have like a really cool fence and entrance area to show for it. Okay, so when we restart Jeffland, we're, we're gonna set up a better dumb land that is more capable of making money. And then we, instead of taking a loan, we're gonna use our own money to start spending money on, like, the beautification process as well, okay? Don't worry, I've got a perfect idea for when we restart. But it's not over yet. It's still not over yet. If we get this loan paid off, we're laughing. But we just have to get to that point. Alright. Why do these rides keep breaking down all the time? What's wrong with it? What's, what is wrong with this? Okay. I need you guys to look at these every 10 minutes from now on, okay? We cannot afford for these rides to keep breaking down. Constantly breaking down. They're too dumb. It's sabotage. Okay, it's fine. We d we dipped into the negative, but we're gonna hold it together. Look, the loan is almost paid off. There, we only lost twenty six bucks last month. That was probably due to due to fence expense. <laughs> it was fence expense. Uh, sir, we noticed some irregularities in your accounting here. There's a whole category here called fence expense. Do you care to elaborate? No! <laughs> it's private! I don't tell anyone about the fence expense! Nobody! Nobody can know! Uh, sir, we're gonna have to take away your business license. No! I need my business! Okay, it's fine. Look, we're back up to... As, as long as we can stay above 400 bucks, guys. If we can stay above 400 bucks, we're laughing. Yeah? Nobody can know. <laughs> Take everything but my fences. Oh my god. We dipped below 400 bucks. Unbelievable. Unbelievable. You know what else is unbelievable? Holy crap. I don't know if any of you guys are following the World Cup, but... Fucking Germany lost. To Mexico. I lost points on my, on my betting. Um, and fucking, uh, fucking Brazil, and, um, wait, who did Brazil play? Switzerland. Drew, for fuck's sake. 
That was garbage. What garbage games. Actually, the, the Germany-Mexico game was pretty exciting, but also shitty, though, because I didn't get any points, but it was pretty good.